I'm, I'm Mrs. Smith, or as they call me, Mama Smith. Um, so thank you so much for coming to this presentation this evening. We're so proud that this event is happening. And I would like to introduce Mr. Greg Toller. Um, he's here tonight. And thank you, Mr. Smith. Michael, Mr. Fuller. I, I could call him Michael. You guys have to call him Mr. Fuller, right? But uh, uh, Joyce, Sharon, of course, thank you very much. Uh, I get goosebumps when I come to the Gateway High School whenever they talk about, obviously, my father, Earl Toller, but uh, more because these young men and women are really taking the next steps for their futures. You know, my father was here in this building in the late 50s through 1974 served in a lot of roles from uh, PE teacher to Dean of Boys, Vice Principal, then eventually the principal of Benjamin Franklin Junior High School at that time. At that time. Uh, what my father did is uh, really instill in his students here to pre be prepared for the opportunities that they're going to be presented in their futures. Every step of the way, he was uh, he did the same at home with us. Uh, at six brothers and sisters, and uh, so we had our own little middle school at home. And it was a very uh, good journey for us, and we learned how to really be prepared for the next opportunity, because opportunity doesn't always knock on your door. You're gonna have to find those doors and really break them down. But what they're doing here at Gateway is, is much of the same that they did back in, in those days with Benjamin Franklin. The administration here cares very much about students here. I've seen it firsthand as being a board member for the last six years. I know how much they care about the students. I know how much they put into their jobs. They have a passion for what they do, and that's one of the most important things that someone can have in order to be successful. <coughs> but what I've seen from these students and the have been in this program that Joyce and Mrs. Smith began is that it's prospered from, you know, three students the first year, and now it's up to 25 I right hear tonight. Well, we have 25 graduates Graduation. seniors. We have maybe 60 kids in the program. 60 kids in the program. <laughs> and, it's, and it's not about just the jackets. You know, the jackets are nice. <laughs> you know, it's a very nice accomplishment, but it's more about the time and the efforts that you've all put into it. Your parents support you, your little brothers and sisters are here tonight, your cousins. They're looking up to you guys now as well. Antonio's made it, now I wouldn't make it. Kitty's made it, now I wouldn't make it. Because you guys are the example that's going to really set this community apart from others. It starts with you, and it's going to prosper with you. It doesn't end with you, because I'm looking at this young guy right here, he's dead. Video game. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So anyway, but um, I'm very proud of you all, and uh, you, you should be proud of yourselves as well. I just want, real quick here, uh, and this is part of it's really tough for me. I have, my nephew passed away two months ago. 16-year-old junior, junior student at Brooklyn High School in Los Angeles. He, he reminds me a lot of the young men and women in this program. He didn't waste any days. He lived every day to the fullest. He was a great young man. Not because he's from total stock, but he was a great young man because he really took advantage of every opportunity that was presented to him. And his presence was so great, it mirrored the presence of my father. And for him, you know, to be taken away, you know, tragically, just a, just a physiological event for some reason, but you know, you know, God has his reason, so I'm not gonna question that. However, he really showed me how I should continue to live. And hopefully, you know, we all will do the same and not waste any days. Don't waste any time with your parents and your families. Take advantage of all the opportunities that are presented to you because there's so much more out there and it's waiting for you to take hold of it. So 
Good luck to you all.